Well, the market time right now is 522 and Social Security recipients are expected to see a boost in their monthly deposit as part of the annual cost of living adjustment. Now, while it's smaller than last year's with inflation rates falling, economists say that you may feel it more. Other changes include upping how much you can make a year before your benefits start getting reduced and how much of earnings are subject to Social Security tax. In the meantime, there's an effort on Capitol Hill to put more money back in the pockets of the nation's parents. A bipartisan tax bill aims to revive and expand the pandemic-era child tax credit. Now, the deal is led by a Democrat in the Senate and a Republican in the House, and it would, go, it would up the payment to a maximum of $2,000 per child. Analyst Chuck Marr with the Center on Budget and Policy Priorities says that, that could be life-changing money for hundreds of thousands of families. 16 million children in low-income families would be met, made better off. Roughly 400,000, 500,000 of them would be lifted above the poverty line. The deal is estimated to cost about $80 billion, which the lawmakers plan to pay for by ending a COVID-era tax credit program that they say is a target for fraud.